Hey, I got a question for you. I'm on the daily grind. I'm taking care of work. I'm getting paid today. I'm doing things to make it right. Is your money working for you? Or are you working for money? It's your boy the Crypto Lifestyle coming back at you once again. You guys know it's that lifestyle where your money works for you instead of you working for that money. And guys, in this video, I'm going to show everybody out there what I am personally honing in on what is the next big category in blockchain technology in cryptocurrency guys we all know how bullish we are all on blockchain infrastructure the neos of the world the icons of the world the eoses of the world the ethereums of the world yes we are big on blockchain networks but let me tell you guys something right now a major major competitor that's going to just blow up the blockchain markets is definitely cloud computing so this is going to be a very very hot category in terms of ICOs so let's check it out I would not be doing a deep dive into these ICOs um, only because not all information is released but I definitely would be doing a full review on deep cloud which is also a cloud computing ICO that will be coming out very shortly. So let's get right to it. Guys, Amcar Network, this is cloud computing. So a distributed cloud computing on trusted hardware. Amcar provides a computation resource efficient blockchain and an integrated data feed system leveraging both cryptographic primitives and trusted hardware. Okay, so right here guys, as I mentioned, there the information that's not all the info we do have the hard cap which is 16 million that is sweet that's well in our striking distance you know i like anything from 20 million to maximum 30 anything below that is just a bonus okay so let us actually check out so we're looking at ankar now the second one is deep cloud so let us go to ankar's actual website guys their vision Cloud computing is projected to be a trillion dollar market, yet it is monopolized by some of the largest tech conglomerates in the world. Only these giants can afford the high human um, capital cost and upfront server costs. But this only results in a higher margin for customers. So it costs us money, okay? It's gonna cost us a lot of money. As you can see here, these are the megalithic companies out there like Alibaba Cloud, we got what is this, Amazon, Microsoft, um, so on and so forth, the apples of the world, okay? So Ankar strives to build a resource efficient blockchain framework that truly enables distributed cloud computing or DCC and provides user-friendly infrastructure for business applications. So just like how blockchain are, is disrupting banks and taking out the middleman, okay, by making it a distributed ledger technology, that's essentially what blockchain is. Now we're seeing this with cloud computing. This is now a distributed cloud computing. That's this technology. It's crazy, guys. You gotta start researching cloud computing, okay? These ICOs are gonna give us a massive returns. And in my opinion, this category in cloud computing is definitely gonna challenge the blockchain infrastructure space that we all would like to get into. Okay, so let's just move on to the next one that I came across, Deep Cloud, where um, my buddy in my chat actually brought this one to my attention. So let's check it out. So Deep Cloud is building an AI-driven decentralized cloud computing platform for running decentralized applications, IoT and Web 3.0 dApps or de uh, decentralized applications. Look at this, guys. The hard caps only 15 million. We are in business, a business. I love to see that under 20 million with such a fabulous technology like cloud computing at a 15 million hard cap. Man, that's a lot of room for us to grow, guys. Okay, so let us go over here. We'll just briefly read, An oh, An not Ankar, sorry guys, Deep uh, Cloud. So computing infrastructure, so sorry, an AI-driven cloud computing infrastructure. Our goal is to demonstrate cloud computing and level the playing field for resource providers and application developers. Okay, um, they actually just partnered up with Nebulous. If you guys don't know Nebulous, they are a top 100, I believe they're 54. Let's just check it out right now. Ah, coin market cap. Let's just check out Nebulous. NEB, there they are. They're like top 60 or 80 or something. Top, look at that, rank 52. So they just partnered up with Nebulous, guys. 
and uh, Nebulous, they have a self-learning machine. It's it's pretty much AI, I would call it. And that's where they're probably going to be implementing the AI technology with cloud computing, okay? With uh, the partnership of Nebulous. So that's pretty darn huge. So what is Deep Cloud AI? We've built a platform to buy and sell compute resources. Deep Cloud AI is building an AI-driven decentralized cloud computing platform for running decentralized applications such as Internet of Things and Web 3.0 or decentralized applications. We will provide a spot market for computing and storage resources for enterprise level users and individuals. So not only just a B2B, but also B2P or P2P, pair to pair, um, sorry, yeah, pair to pair or business to uh, pair. For the purpose of sharing their excess capacity and our decentralized cloud and with our AI matching engine, okay? Applications will execute in secure sandbox and peer-to-peer -peer resources, and all transactions are managed on the blockchain via smart contracts. This is an amazing project, guys, okay? Keep your eyes out for Deep Cloud. I highly recommend people join the actual Telegram group, get the latest of the latest. I will do a full depth review on Deep Cloud. I just wanna bring to everyone's attention what I am looking at, and that is cl cloud computing when it comes to ICOs. Blockchain infrastructures are just mad, mad, overly hyped, but for good reason. But my problem with that is this. Let us go to the actual, um, where is it? Deep Cloud, nope. Let's go to AirBlock for one second. I'll show you guys why I'm getting kind of frustrated with all of these ICOs. As you can see here, the public ICO details, round one lottery, okay? Um, 1500 ETH, this is, this is for AirBlock. Minimum contribution is 0.5, the max is one ETH. What, what on God's green earth are people gonna do with that? I mean, like, yes, I know one ETH is a lot to many people, and it is, you know, but come on, man. It's almost like these ICO companies are the ones in control, you know? They're like, oh, yeah, we're the ones in control, so we don't really, um, we call the shots. But before, they were looking for people like us, the vast majority of investors that come from the public, the masses. But now, they're catering only for um, these private strategic investors, and we come last. Okay, guys, we used to be second to none. Now we're just being treated as, okay, well, you know, we'll get the bottom of the barrel stuff and bits and pieces. You know, like, I know I sound repetitive, but we do KYC, we do whitelisting, um, we do a quiz. You know, you pass the quiz, then you get into a lottery, and then hopefully you pass that. If you get lucky enough to be chosen, and then um, you only are limited to an amount that you could actually contribute. Nah, I um, I don't know. I, that doesn't really sit well with me. But anyways, guys, that's a video for another day. There you have it. I went over Ankara Network, Deep Cloud. You guys join the Telegram chat to get the latest of the latest over there. I'm definitely going to be honing in on cloud computing when it comes to ICOs and I'm merging that with blockchain technology, guys. It's your boy, The Crypto Lifestyle, coming back at you once again, giving you the latest of the latest. We briefly went over Ankar Network. We briefly went over Deep Cloud. I will be doing a full depth in view on Deep Cloud within a week. Um, so there ain't really much left to say other than until the next video, you're on your own. Later. Anyway.